We need to talk. Well, well, well. If it isn't Rex Ryan, taking a break from tackling freshman schoolgirls to pay little low me a visit. Okay, first of all, she wasn't wearing her ID. What was I supposed to do? But that's besides the point. I have something that needs detecting. Where'd you get this? Same place you did. On my locker. There's clearly some kind of conspiracy against us, Jenkins. Repeat, target it! I'm thinking you and I team up to bring these savages, whoever they are, to justice. Well, forgive me if I'm hesitant to work with a, um, <clears throat> a hall monitor. You think I want to work with you? You're a juvenile delinquent who eats Reese's Puffs alone in his counselor's office. Hey, don't get fresh with me, Stevie Wonder. I'm not the one who goes around picking fights with teenage girls. But I guess you're right. We have no choice but to work together. And until we find out who's been doing this, everyone's a suspect. Okay then, let's go. Just look at the poster, Jenkins. It's clear we're dealing with a professional of graphic design. I say we interrogate someone from the graphic design club. Did you make this? Did you make this message? Huh? What? No, it looks like it's been made by a seven-year-old. Okay, but did anyone in your club make this? No, we work in Photoshop. It looks like it's been made in paint, I swear to God. Swear to me! I swear! Swear to me! Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Then what do you suggest we do? Well, I have an idea. <clears throat> but you're not gonna like it. I mean, it makes sense. You know, new scene is filled with technically savvy kids who work incredibly hard on videos no one will ever see. I mean, these are some of the saddest, most overworked kids in the entire school. Oh, look, here comes that one. Shut up, Jenkins. Yeah, you see, see what I mean? I hate you people. Yeah. I mean, if people actually watched the morning announcements, you might have been prom security this year. Well, I've moved on to bigger things. I'm doing security for Radium Girls tonight at 7.30. Hmm, really? Well, not exactly. I'm going to be standing there outside the door and giving intimidating looks to people as they walk in. <clears throat> Excuse me. Does this look familiar to you? Oh yeah, that was me. What, what? Declan, why? Because I hate you people. I worked for hours each week on New Scene trying to make this school look as good as it could by the time I graduated. But you two have ruined my work. Do you think they have to deal with an incompetent detective or a dim-witted hall monitor at any other school? No. You're turning OPRF into a laughing stock. If you genuinely think that you have helped a single person at this school, then you're even more delusional than I thought you were. <laughs> Crying? No. Hey, don't don't take Declan too seriously, okay? The kid's just being dramatic. No, he's right. I've been home honor for four years and I haven't helped a single person. A hall monitor is supposed to keep those students up the school. Say. <laughs> I look at my hands, and all I see is destruction. Okay, look, you've done some regrettable things in the past, but you're a senior. You're gonna graduate, okay? It's not too late to become the person that you want to be. You really mean that? Yeah, sure. Now, do you want to clean this guy's clock or what? Let's do this. I suppose the two of you are going to uh, beat me up together and take me to detention? No, that's not how Rex Ryan operates anymore. I'm a changed man. I'll give you a 10 second head start. Yeah. Wait. Thank you for what you said, Jenkins. You're a good man. Okay, well I know that already, but don't forget, it's not too late for you to be one too. It's all over. But the grind has
And nobody's crying but me